as a type 1 diabetic and you travel over time zones, your sugar levels naturally go up and down because it's breaking your daily rhythm. Right now I'm in Schiphol Airport in Amsterdam and I'm on my way to Australia. But first we're going to London and then Dubai and then Australia. It's quite a long trip. My sugar levels were really high for the past week because probably all of the excitement. Well, I've still like been eating a low carb diet and I've been drinking a lot of green juices and stuff. So I think it's mainly the excitement that's like making my sugar levels go up and down. My mom ordered a diabetic meal before the flight. Little did we know, when you get your diabetic meal on the flight, it's loaded with carbs. But luckily my mom packed some healthy low-carb snacks for the flight. I'm in Sydney right now, we just landed from the flight from Dubai, and there was toasties with bread and potatoes and like lots of carb things. Three o'clock this morning, like there was, they came in with those toasty sandwiches. It was the only thing to eat, so like I just ate it. My sugar levels were surprisingly really good, except for the one time after I ate that toasty, it was 15. I would have preferred to have like meals like with more vegetables and meat instead of like bread. I think the airlines are following the same guidelines as the diabetic clinics, and once we change the, the guidelines in the diabetic clinics, then the airlines can serve low-carb meals for diabetics.